Hey everybody, welcome back to another exciting episode of Mystery Toys, where I open up two blind box or two blind bag items and see what we get. Now today, by request, we finally got some more sister location in Five Nights at Freddy's Part 4. Sorry, I missed that last time. Uh, Funko Mystery Minis. Not only that, but we got Toys R Us exclusives. Yeah. So, thank you guys. I have not really played um, 4 that much, and I have not played Sister Location at all. So, I am going to screw up a lot of these names. But you guys are usually really good about helping uh, educate me on what I'm getting wrong, which I do appreciate. So, we got some 1 in 6s in here. The exclusives are all 1 in 36 and 1 in 24, so that's a little bit of a bummer. Um, I don't entirely remember. I think I've only opened 2 or 4 of these, and I don't remember exactly which ones I've got. So, I don't know if I can actually spoil it for you guys, but... Did not get the cupcake. Neither one of these are too are too light to get the cupcake. But you know what? Let's just jump in here and see what we're gonna get. Here, I'll tell you what. While I'm working on the plastic, let you guys kind of look on that because this is not easily tearing plastic. This is actually fully shrink wrapped. And there we go. Finally got that one open. All right. Let's get it out the bag and see what we got. All right. So I'm doing a little feel. It's got like one nub on the head, not a hat nub. Kind of, okay, okay. Almost like a tutu dress. Anybody got a tutu dress that would stick out with a one nub? Looks like maybe this one right there that I have no idea what that is. No idea whatsoever. That looks like a sister location pop. I really, see I'm a console guy mostly. I know I could do it mobile, but yeah, okay. But I would, you know, I don't know. That is cool though. It's creepy as hell, but definitely tell me who this one is because I'm not familiar with that character at all. That is a lot of great detail on there too. Some great paint work. And what is that one? That's a one in 12, so that's good, that's good. Better than one in six. There's the feet, if anybody needs those numbers or whatever. Cool. All right, well I like it, because it's creepy. And I like them, I like it creepy. Um, I think I made a reference to a movie just now. I was trying, I don't know if that's the exact line. I haven't watched, it's one of my favorites, but I haven't watched it in a couple of years. All right, let's see what the next one's gonna be. We got the shrink wrap off. Let's tear that damn thing open. All right, we got a fat head with propellers and arms to the side. So I guess we got, is it Balloon Boy? I think is what he's called. He's a one in 24, so that's pretty cool. Pretty sure there's nothing else that could be. So let's open him up and let's find out. Nope, I'm sorry, it's Chica. <laughs> Ooh, that's an awesome Chica. So that's a 1 in 12 Chica, that's fine, that's all right. Let's just take a little look around. I love that she's got the cupcake on the plate. It is a she, right? I think Chica's a she. Again, if I'm wrong, you guys let me know. <laughs> I can't be right about everything all the time. <laughs> and I'm waiting for somebody to post the comment, wait, you were right about something? When? <laughs> oh man, that's really cool though. There's great detail going on in there. Nice paintwork. I love that one. That's one of the favorite ones I've seen, actually. One of my favorite ones. Well, cool, guys. There you go. That's uh, that's that episode of Mystery Toys, and I'll try to get some more of these, because I do like them, and eventually I'll get around to playing those games. I really wish they'd bring them out to consoles. Like, you know, even just like a simple, like maybe on the Switch or something. Actually, I'd love it on the Switch, because that way I can still have it mobile, too. I mean, I guess I can have it mobile on my phone. Eh, whatever. I'm going to play it eventually. <laughs> Let me know, though, guys. What do you think about these? Are you collecting them? Who else has exclusives? Which ones are you still looking for? Um, what would you like to see in future series? If you've got any thoughts on that, let me know. Definitely educate me on who the hell that one is. And uh, drop me some comments and let me know. Other than that, though, you can click that thumbs up button. Give me that good old thumb of encouragement, because I do love to be encouraged. All right, I'm going to get out of here, go open up some more stuff, and I'll see you all later. Later.